Hey guys, it's Femi here. Welcome to another video. Today I'm going to be putting together an inverter. That might sound hard, but it's quite easy. All we have to do is follow the diagram at the top of the screen to connect the charger to the battery and to the inverter. I'm going to be connecting the batteries in parallel because if when they are connected, they can be able to last longer because the amperage increase instead of the voltage and that's what we want so we can have a long lasting battery set the battery comes in at 15,000 naira, and the more batteries you have the longer you can use your inverter for here i have 12 batteries each of the batteries are 18 amps and since i have 12 batteries that means 18 times 12 which gives us 216 amps before I go on, please if this is your first time of watching my videos, please give this video a like and subscribe and turn on post notifications so you can know when I drop a new video. Thanks. Now that I'm done with the connection of the batteries in parallel, I can bring in the inverter now. If you're considering building an inverter system for your home, you can drop a comment down below and we can form a quote on what is suitable for you i can know what you want to run with it and i'll give you the best thing that works for you also if you want to build it i'm also available for that i'll do that also in a little while i'll be adding solar panels to this inverter to make it completely clean <laughs> i almost forgot the inverter this is a 3 kva inverter from sora which cost 17,800, and it's actually not bad for this project because it's very very powerful and can carry almost any amount of load you want to drop on it it's not a good idea to put the inverter directly on the floor now till we get a panel so we can get power this from the sun we are going to be using a wall charger the wall charger just plug it in whenever there's light or we run in the gen it gets charged and keeps energy there for us whenever we need it the charger I'm using is also from SOA, which comes in at 10,000 naira. I like this model because it has a knob at the back that can allow you adjust how much amps you want it to deliver. Now I'm sure someone will say, oh why would I get an inverter when I have my generator? Well I just want to list a few reasons why personally I feel inverters are better than the generators. Number one reason why I will pick an inverter over a generator is because inverters are silent. I want to get up by 2 a.m. I don't care. I want to watch something. I want to walk, and I will start having those noise in me. I don't want that. Also, compared to generators, inverters have low running cost. You don't. They don't really need maintainers as such. Also, based on how you set them up. When Nepal takes the lights, they can automatically come up. And please don't be intimidated by the number of batteries you see here. You can start from as low as 4 batteries. You get quite a long time for you to use. Also, if you have a UPS at home and you feel you can use that instead of buying an inverter, I have a video in the description and at the end of this video showing you how to go about that